We want to make sure that we have the best equipment aligned to industry, aligned to what post-secondary offers to give our students the best education and preparedness for that next step. BusinessJournalDaily.com. Three Minutes With is brought to you by Farmers National Bank. I like a bank that's a pillar in my community. I like a bank so cutting edge, they have a lab branch. We are so alike. Well, we do both bank at Farmers National Bank. Farmers. Stand strong. Right now we're located up on the second floor of Schaff and Corinne Technical Center here in Youngstown and this program is the music production and recording and it's a brand new program this year. We started it um, from an idea about a year and a half ago during COVID and we wanted to expand the arts um, on, on our floor here. This is kind of known as the Arts Academy, if you will, the Academy of Arts here at Schaffen. It's a two-year program. They come uh, first year as a junior and uh, go into their senior year so they're here for with us for two years and our goal is to prepare the students to uh, be college ready if they if they choose to continue their music education at the collegiate level um, whether it's you know music education performance will help them prepare their uh, their auditions if the student prefers to start working in the field right away we try to equip them to uh, do that as well. So whether they want to get into a studio as a mix engineer uh, or whatever or a performing musician, um, we really kind of tailor um, what we do to, this, to the individual. Is pretty much teach the students about the different softwares that um, that we deal with. Pretty much is Logic, uh, Garage Bands, and another program that we just rec recently had is Luna. So on those particular programs, what we do, we record different parts: bass, drums, piano, guitar, and vocals. And uh, also, what we do is uh, we teach the kids how to pretty mix and master their songs. We want to make sure that we have the best equipment aligned to industry, aligned to what post-secondary offers, to give our students the the best education and preparedness for that next step. It's funded through our Perkins grant mostly which is a federal uh, funding for CTE education and the Perkins grant allows us to align with what our main needs are in career tech education, develop programming around that and our focus for music was to give non-traditional students in the district an opportunity to have that career tech experience. They can actually be an artist. They can actually be an artist based off how hard they want to work, how far they want to go. Uh, if they want to be a, a sound technician or anything like that, of course, they got, I'm sure there's some things here that we can place them in in the city. And two, uh, the sky's the limit. Uh, there's some different things outside the city. There's some opportunities that people will be actually searching for as far as uh, a sound man or a vocalist or some musicians. We have them prepared for any of those situations that come up. The students that come in here have broad options based on their skills that they bring to the table and interests because 100% we are all about the interests of the student. We're not here to you know dictate what they do and shape them. We want to grow them based on what they've shaped themselves and have them realize the opportunity that that comes with that and as they bring out those skills and, and those talents. BusinessJournalDaily.com. Three Minutes With is brought to you by Farmers National Bank. I like a bank. That's a pillar in my community. I like a bank so cutting edge, they have a lab branch. We are so alike. Well, we do both bank at Farmers National Bank. Farmers. Stand strong.